hi guys welcome back to my channel thank you guys for tuning in so in today's video i'll be showing you guys how i dry my catfish so guys i know that this thing is going to is going to give me time and it's a whole lot of stress but but i need to do this because i really need a dry fish this cat dry fish so that uh when baby is finally here i will <laughs> I'll, I'll have fish that i will use to do my omogo yeah <laughs> that is that is the essence of going through this stress okay so guys i want to start by cutting and uh, washing this fish yeah after washing it i will just add cutting and washing i'll add salt to marinate then i'll put it inside the fridge tomorrow i will start the the roasting i will be making use of uh, my oven i have two oven here i will make use of this one and this one too this particular one so i'm ready for the fish yeah i'm ready so <laughs> so guys I will not be showing you because uh, everywhere is occupied. I will not be showing you maybe the washing and the, the washing process and the cutting process. Maybe if I finish cutting and the washing, I will show you guys because everywhere is full. Look at inside my sink is fish, 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 fish. One, this particular one inside the nylon. I will use this one. There is tilapia here. There is sherry and the rest. This one, I will use this one. Just... I will dry everything. This one I will dry it to so now look like bunga fish. Yeah, this particular one. I so guys, I'm done washing the fish, cutting and washing. Guys, this took me like two hours. Although my husband helped me in cutting it, but to wash this fish, oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. I am so exhausted. So this is the catfish. Everywhere is fish, fish. Everywhere is many. Oh my god. So I will see you guys tomorrow when I will start the drying process. So I'll see you guys tomorrow, okay? Stay tuned. Okay guys, this one is the tilapia and the, the tilapia fish. Look at how it is and uh, the maximum I put, uh, one hour. And look at how so dry it is. Are you seeing that? Now look like a um, bunga fish, I don't know what it's called. So this is this one. Okay guys, good morning everyone. So this is the next morning and uh, this is the fish. I'm taking it out from the fridge batch by batch. The first thing I have to do now is to take some vegetable oil now and uh, grease the pan because I don't want it to, to stick. After greasing the pan, I'll grease the pan very very well. Then I also take the fish. I marinate it with salt last night. I put from inside the freezer. So I will just uh, rub it on the body, the oil, and place. Oh yeah. inside the oven now I'll close and turn it on 60 minutes then set it up and down 200 degree okay 250 degree Fahrenheit the last one and thus I will leave this for the 60 minutes this is after one hour and then uh, 
stuff never dry yo. after one hour and this is the outcome it takes time to dry that means this fish i'm going to put it back for for another one hour let me small work day here hey let me small work oh so I'm going to put it, turn it over and uh, put it back for another one hour to see if it's going to dry. So guys, after two hours, this is what the fish looks like. This is two hours, see? The inside, I don't think the inside is well dry though, but uh, I will take it out, I'm not going to put it back in the oven. All I will do now is just for me to take it outside sun, because here in Qatar it's very very hot outside, so that sun can help me uh, dry the remaining one, so I can put the rest, because I, said, I have enough fish here guys. Two, two hours look at how many pieces now it takes two hours one two three four five six seven eight although i want to use big my big oven but i noticed that my gas just finished so i'll be using only the electric for this particular small one so that is it look at it guys look at it so i'm going to take it outside now then i'll put the second batch so each set is two hours two hours two hours so that is it don't worry after the drying process i will show you guys it's okay it's very nice i'll show you guys the outcome the finished product okay guys this one is the third stage for today guys since morning i've been roasting this fish <laughs> this is the first um, the third stage and uh, this one did very well this one did very well guys To roast this thing is not easy. It's not easy at all. And I'm doing some house, small, small house choice. So it has not been easier for me, but I'm trying. So this is the third stage. I'm going to put the last one now. Not really the last one though. There is still enough. But this is the quantity I'm going to dry. Then the rest, my husband says I can, I can keep the rest for pepper soup because i cook pepper soup last night with this fish and it tastes so great so he said that i should not dry all i should so after this last one i showed you guys i am done with it then tomorrow morning i will take it out outside the sun that the sun to for finish for for kata sun to finish work there <laughs> so it's still okay this one i this one was a either two hours two hours and 30 minutes inside the oven and uh, as you can see it's very very dry hi guys this is the last one I just took this one out from the oven now. And, uh, three hours inside the oven, and this is it's very, very dry. So dry. So, guys, I'm done. What is the time now? The time now is uh, 11 pm. This is what I started 11 in the morning. Okay? It's not discouraging. It's not as if that anyone that wants to do it, I'm discouraging you guys. No. If you really don't know what it's like, if you really like dry fish, the, the stress what's it. Okay? This one is the... Uh, the what is it called? Tilapia fish. And uh, I first... And, uh, Great this one. So this is what it looks like. It's very very dry. 
this one then this ones are the catfish there are still some a lot is still in the freeze but the guys i'm done this one at least this one can go a long way for us i'm done i'm exhausted let me go with those ones then the ones inside for you can use it for pepper soup or any other thing or vegetable or crew. but you see those ones here guys i am done i'm done i'm done so this is very very nice guys if you want to um dry your catfish this is the best way to do it and trust me it will come out so well thank you guys for watching if you watch up until this moment you are the best please consider subscribing if you have not and uh, share this video like and give me your thoughts on the comment section below okay so this is my fish this is what my fish looks like i am going to enjoy Angel, 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 angel. This one is a mogul fish <laughs> for miracle. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm getting ready for this baby. <laughs> All right, guys. Thank you so much. Bye bye. And I will see you guys in my next video. Shukran.